so perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. This is the lineup we've been given. How do you read it, Jim? I think you get a, a terrible raw deal these days. It's deemed old fashioned, outdated, but in truth, with the, the right personnel, it works just as well as, as any other system or formation. Success can still be had with it, and teams are still winning big trophies with exactly this setup. There's the whistle. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Riyad Mahrez. He's one of the best dribblers around, Peter, with such delicate close control and, and wonderful balance. He could finish with the best of them too, so I wouldn't be surprised to see him score a few cracking individual efforts for this team. He looked... Bernardo Silva! A great save, real class. Bernardo Silva is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Romeo. Romeo drives it forward. Southampton seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. Huh? Oh, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. McCarthy sends that a long way. Bednarek. He's pulled him up for that challenge. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Mondi. Mendy plays it forward. Sterling tries to stroke it through. And the finish! And again the keeper stands strong. Mares clearly thought he'd done enough. The save was like a bolt from the blue. Played it short. Sterling. And Sterling! Oh, another save. Sterling can only think of disappointment right now, but he'll get to appreciate just how good that save was. This could spell goes for goal! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. That's not the ball he wanted. Now it's Ings. Gundogan. De Bruyne. And here's Mares. A really good feat. Kyle Walker. Gundogan. Quick glance at Gott Sterling! Bednarek. And we've reached half-time. Both sides have drawn blanks. 
have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Look we'll back on the first 45 minutes. Yeah, the scoreline doesn't tell the whole story. And we're off again. Manchester City clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Hoists it forward. Ings desperately wants to get on the end of this. Kyle Walker. De Bruyne. And it's Mares. Gundogan. And here's Gabriel. De Bruyne clips one through. Sterling. Towering header. It's there. What a super header. Dispatched beautifully. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch. And it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Manchester City break the deadlock. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out. It's paid off here. the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition it already has actually Peter I can't stress great leap he's done well to get his head on that but couldn't score Southampton can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source Walker Peters forward it goes Get a throw in. Bernardo Silva. And it's played forward. Sterling is onto it and can take it up. So who's he picking out? Sterling. Sterling plays it backwards. Has a hit! That's surely a foul free kick. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. The ref's been lenient here, and down he'll get too many more chances. De Bruyne! Sterling. Sterling decides to play it back. Over to the left. Oh, nice touch. Plenty waiting in the middle. Strong punch. Zinchenko. And here's... Jesus has a goal! Oh, and that should have been two. Yeah, he knew only too well that to concede then would have been tough to recover from. That could prove a big moment in this game.
I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Ings gets into a dangerous position. Gabriel Jesus. Bednarek is there and he can get that clear. Walker Peters tries to get it forward quickly. So that's it, it is all over. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Well, this game looked to have nil-nil written all over it, but credit to them, they upped their game in the end, and I thought they got what they deserved.